translation. This figure here is going to move under the translation of EF. So all points will move in the same direction and they'll move the same distance. So this distance EF is 100, so each point will move 100 in the direction of EF. This here is a piece of paper wrapped around two pencils. As I rotate the pencils, the image moves forward. And that's moved under translation. We take this figure here and we want to move it under translation EF. Draw the image of the kite under the translation EF. This is the kite and this is the translation EF. So each point will move in the direction of EF and the same distance as EF. So draw from each point on the kite parallel to EF. Set the compass to the length of EF and step it off on each line. And now line in the new shape. And that is the translation under EF. In next the points we A becomes A1 and B becomes B1 and so on. Second question here is draw the image of the figure which has a circle in it on the translation or S. First thing draw through each point parallel to the or S translation line. Set the compass to the length RS, put the point of compass in each point and step off on the corresponding line. We didn't mark B there because when we draw in the triangle it will be on the line that was drawn up from B. Set the compass to the radius of the circle, put the point of compass in the new centre and draw the circle. And now index the points A1, B1, C1 and D1. And that's the image under translation RS.